Control Chart and Run Chart are two essential quality control tools. Both of them are used for evaluating and analyzing quality results within a project or a process. When you look at these charts, you will have an insight into the health of the process. There are seven tools for quality control. Check Sheet. Control Chart. Fishbone Diagram, Cause and Effect Diagram. Flow Chart. Histogram. Pareto Chart. Scatter Diagram. What is a run chart? A run chart is a simple chart that shows data points over a period of time. The displayed data in a run chart mostly show trends, the performance of manufacturing, etc. Typically it is a two-dimensional graph in which one axis shows time and the other axis shows the value. A run chart helps you analyze the following over time. Changes or trends of the process. The cycle of the process. Performance of a process. For the project performance measurement, you can draw planned and actual progress lines with the help of run charts. After creating the project schedule, you can extract the planned figures and draw the planned progress curve. As the project progresses, you can insert the actual figures and draw the actual progress curve. This is an example for the usage of run charts. Benefits of run chart. It is a visual tool that is easy to draw and use. It enables to determine the performance of a process easily. It does not require too many technical skills. It is a communication tool that enables to make decision making. Limitations of run chart. A run chart is not related to statistical control limits. Therefore, you cannot see the major and minor tolerance limits. It does not provide you enough information regarding the stability and trends of the process. What is a control chart? A control chart is a specific type of graph that shows data points between upper and lower limits over a period of time. These charts commonly have three types of lines such as upper and lower specification limits, upper and lower limits and plan value. By the help of these lines, control charts show the process behavior over time. A control chart helps you to understand if the process is under control or not. If the results are beyond the control limits you can say that there is an error in the product or process. Benefits of Control Chart It enables to specify the stability of a process. It enables to specify the regions where the quality needs to be improved or where the corrective actions need to be taken. It enables to analyze the variations between the given limits. It provides a general view of your process on a single chart. Limitations of Control Chart If the upper and lower threshold limits are determined incorrectly, the results will cause wrong decisions. It requires a piece of basic knowledge of statistical terms and concepts in order to interpret the curves.